Welcome to this exhibit pack update. This week I will focus a little bit more on Cedar and Rowan and their relationship with their pack mates. They're now five months old and weighing around 70, 75 pounds. Right around six months old, pups are usually almost the same size of adults, but there's certainly some growth left after that. Um, in this video, you can see Grayson grooming the pups while they rest, starting with Cedar and now finishing up with Rowan here. Um, we're still seeing some nurturing behaviors and a lot of um, very pup-like behaviors, right? Um, here's uh, Rowan doing some food begging to Rika and she regurgitates. So even here towards the end of, the, of September uh, into the fall, we still see some of that some of those nurturing behaviors. And here you can see he lays down and he starts eating it up, uh, guarding it a little bit. But here again, uh, a different day, they food beg to Rika. So those food begging behaviors include a lot of following in a very submissive way and doing a lot of muzzle licking. Um, and that really triggers that regurgitation for her. Um, in that case, the pups were probably full and maybe not as interested in whatever she gave. So uh, she came back and just ate it. Um, and speaking of food, you know, they are very independent and they can get food from the carcass on their own. Here you can see that Rika approaches these carcass items after a feeding and her ears go sideways and Cass kind of intercepts. He's definitely guarding those, um, those deer heads and, and beaver carcasses. But pay close attention how he steals that deer head from that pup. Um, so even though he's been really good at sharing food, um, you can every now and then see him steal food or do some tug of war with the pups. So very interesting to watch. Definitely a very Kaz move as one of the most food motivated wolves here that we have in our pack. Now I wanted to give you all a little bit of a, an update on how to identify or distinguish between the pups at this point. They're going to keep changing. We've always said that Rowan has kind of a, a longer muzzle and broader face, while Cedar, um, he's kind of getting a broader face now, but he has a shorter muzzle. Um, their coats are a little bit different. Um, Rowan has a fuller coat. He looks a little bit more fluffy, while Cedar is a little bit more kind of slim. Uh, also in the tail, you know, Cedar is developing at this point a little bit of a silver line around his scent gland while Rowan doesn't quite have that. But you still see those tones of maybe more warm tones with Rowan and more cool tones with Cedar. So we continue to see that and it'll continue to change. So keep watching and we'll keep you updated.